reason I couldn't, I had to ask Nasir to speak first because I was dying to hear it, what he had to say about Mr. Nair, and it's, uh, it was absolutely an amazing experience. Nasir, thank you so much. Um, I just have to mention two things here. One, of course, Mr. Nair, and Mr. Nair ke liye Hindi mein kaha gaya hai ke wo suraj ko diya dikhane wali baat hai. Unko kya, unki kya tarif kare hum? Jis insaan ne absolutely, selflessly kaam kiya aur what, what uh, you know, Shiva just said, um, let me tell you exactly what happened. I went to Pune and I saw him and his family was there. And I told uh, Shiva, I said, you know, bring him here, put him in Leelavati, get him the best hospital in the world, and I'll take care. And what he said to Shiva is what Shiva said, tell him to, you know, preserve movies instead of me. Which man can talk like that but Mr. Nair? So, claps for him, please. <laughs> he was also, uh, of course, he was preserving movies, as Mr. Ben Engel said, as uh, Shiva said, but to me also, he was creating filmmakers. If I'm here, I'm here because of P.K. Nair. I think he taught us cinema in his own way. Uh, he was always there with his little torch, uh, as Nasir was mentioning, and uh, you know, writing his little notes. And he was a very quiet, serious man. And if, let's say, if I wanted to study a film, there was a film called Breathless, but by Jean-Long Godard I saw when I was very young, and I wanted to see the film again. So I made a request, and he said no. And he walked away, and, and it was a night screening in main theater, and he just told the projectionist, keep the print here for the night, okay? And he walked away. Dalvi, keep the print, and Kogji, I remember. And after he'd gone, Dalvi walked up to me and I said, Nair Sab said, he can't officially give you the print, but just sneak, take it tonight, study it, and give it back to me in the morning. That's Mr. Nair for you. I mean, to me, absolutely. So, uh, and I still remember, Nasir was me, there's a shot, a long shot, hai, oh, enter Katha and then you go up in the room. So I wondered, ke, are, aisa kyun, kaise shot ho gaya? And then I realized that there was actually a slight tilt in the long shot, and there was a cut, camera was still tilting to the close-up. And if you remember in Khamosh, we tried that. He hated it, he was in the pool, <laughs> tilting up, and he kept saying his director's dance. But, uh, but I danced to the tune of Mr. Nair, because he's the one who taught me all those uh, great movies and how to see films. Uh, and the second thing I want to talk for long is the, the condition of archival things in this country. Uh, let me say something that will tell you how terrible the whole situation of archiving is. Uh, while Mr. Devanand was alive, I really wanted to have, uh, I had sponsored some books on Guru Dutt, uh, and I wanted to uh, sponsor books on Guide and you know all, and I wanted him to talk and how he made the films and so he said, but is me paise kitne hai? I said, sir, koi aapko nahi dena hai. Hum, hum preserve karenge aur aapi ka copyright. There's nothing. But Vinod, what are you getting? I said, sir, mere ko kuch nahi mil raha hai. Main naam bhi nahi apna lagaunga. Ye aapi ka hai. He was not convinced. So actually, that opportunity that we had of people sitting and talking to him and how he made guide which so and, you know, was lost because he couldn't believe that I was doing it just because I wanted to preserve whatever he had in his mind when he made those films. And this is my appeal to everybody and if film industry or anybody is listening, that they should help people like Shiva because they are selflessly trying to preserve films, which is what Mr. Nair did. So there is nothing in, in archive. So we should all, I mean, Nasir and me made a great film. I, I don't know. I talk of my films as great films, but not so great, perhaps. <laughs> it was a film called Satya Katha, which was my first film with Nasir and Om Puri. And um, it, it was a film about Nasir was playing a cop in Bombay. And the film was all about this cop had his duty to, if there's a dead body on the streets, it was his duty to take it to the morgue. But if the body's alive, or if the person is alive, he couldn't do anything. So it was a film about a conflict of a policeman, which he played brilliantly. 
Uh, the film was not that great, but he was great. <laughs> so, so he played that role, and he, you know, every time he used to take a little round and come back if the person has died. And it was one of, I think, one of my better films, uh, and it's lost. It's not there. And I tried to look for it almost 10 years back, Mr. Benegal, not now. I, people went to DD, they couldn't find the negative, and it was shot on reversal 16mm negative. So it's all gone. And Om Puri was brilliant in that. That was also his first film with me. Uh, so it's very sad that this happens, and I would only request you, everybody, whoever is listening, to try and help, because this is how the future generations would learn. We learned from Mr. Nair, and it's very sad when I see all the students of cinema in this country only reading about how Martin Scorsese did that. Of course, I greatly respect him, how this director shot, how Francis Coppola shot, how this guy shot, how Roberto, and you know, it's, but do they know how Gurudat made films? Did, do they know how Mehboob Khan made films? Do they know how Kiyasif made films? And Bimal Roy made films, and Raj Kapoor made films? Not really. And it's very, very sad that our students are learning cinema, which is not really our coming from our roots. They're talking, they're listening to, you know, all Western books on script writing. They're talking about third act. I see these young writers working. Oh, so what is there in third act? I said, in Hindi cinema, there is no third act. There's music, you know. But, but they don't know, and it's very sad. I think I want to end. I talk too much that archival things, Everybody should please help, and if the government is listening, we can honor Mr. Nair as much as we can, but I think the government of India needs to wake up and give Mr. Nair some Padma Bhushan Vibhushan because he was the only one in this country who gave his life for cinema and, and taught all of us to be here. Thank you very much. Can I now request uh, Naisab Bina and uh, Naisab's daughter and son to be here for the book release? And Rajesh Devraj, our editor of the book, can he come up on stage? Rajesh, I 